La Flyer Nation YouTube game, what it do, man? It's your boy Def here. I already know the vibes, man. We're back with another daily video, man. I told you, boys, I got y'all all year, man. And next year with the daily content, y'all. And the daily streams on the Twitch, man. If you ain't followed the Twitch already, man, it's down below. It's showing right now. Oop, it just went away. But it's the same as my YouTube and all my other socials, man. Duffy LaFleur. Make sure y'all follow the Twitch up, man. The streams be lit, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all now. But look, before we have a video today, go ahead and drop a like on the video right now, man. Let's get the video to 30 likes, man. If you didn't know, man, liking up the video helps the video get pushed to recommend it. And, you know, that's always appreciated by y'all. So, yeah, man, make sure y'all like up the video. If you're new to the channel, man, do not forget to hit the subscribe button, man. I've been posting every single day since the prelude has dropped. I have not missed an upload. So, man, hey, if you can hit that sub button, man, it's, hey, I really would appreciate that, man. But look, what else do I finish? I think I'm finna say something else. Oh, yeah, make sure you tell your notice on, y'all. Make sure y'all tell your notice on so you don't miss the daily content. And if you follow my Twitch, don't forget to turn the notice on there, too, for the daily streams over there, too. But look, I ain't gonna waste too much more of y'all's time today. Let's go ahead and jump straight into the video. Yeah, if you're hearing this, man, you got caught lacking, man. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. All right, y'all, as y'all can see, man, from the thumbnail in the title today, I got the best offensive threat build in this game. This build is not really seen as much because eh, you got to make it weird. I ain't going to lie. But it's, it's really good. It's a really good build still, trust me. But um, this build was definitely really popularized in... um. 2k20 it was a lot of old threats bro it's a lot of offensive threats in um 2k20 and there's a lot of play shots but this year you got majority play shots you don't have that many offensive threats but look we're gonna jump into this man starting out with the position you want to rock with a point guard position let me take oh man whatever hand you want let me take this football number off man let me go ahead and put my one piece on for the skill breakdown aka the pie chart man you want to rock with the play shot pie chart the one that's half playmaking and half uh shooting for the physical profile, you want to rock with the fastest physical profile, man, because y'all know speed kills on the guard. All right, now for these attribute upgrades, man, pay close attention to what I put here. So, <clears throat> excuse me. So you can get the best possible outcome for this offensive threat build. <clears throat> Dang, sheesh. Need some water. All right, <laughs> um, starting out with finishing, man, you want to go to max your close shot, max your layup, max your dunk, max your uh, standard dunk, and then bring your post hooks up to a 70. And that'll leave you with nine finishing badges. For shooting, you want to bring your mid-range shot up to an 87. And then your three-point shot all the way out, maxed out. And that'll leave you with 16 shooting badges. For um, playmaking, you want to max your pass accuracy and then max your ball handling. And that'll give, leave you with 21 playmaking badges. Now for defense, you want to go ahead and max your perimeter, max your lateral, max your steal. And then put the rest on your defensive rebound. And that'll leave you with six defensive badges. Right now, we're looking at nine finishing, 16 shooting, 21 playmaking, and six defensive badges. For the body shape, um, for me personally, on my smaller guard builds, like 6'2", 6'3", like basically 6'3 and under, I like to go slight. And on my all my ISO builds that are like 6'4 and up, I like to go burly. So this build is going to be 6'2 in particular, so I'm going to go with the slight body shape. For the height, you want to go 6'2". For the weight, you want to drop the weight all the way down so you can get this 99 speed at 99 overall. And for the wingspan, you want to max the wingspan out. Trust me, you would be shooting perfectly fine with the 83 three-pointer, bro. I did it with my other, um, what's it called, build? My other build had a low ball, had a lower three-pointer with this, and I shot perfectly fine, bro. All you need is your jump shot boost, your hot zones, and a good jump shot, and you'll be just fine, bro. Trust me. You have Hall of Fame shooting badges, bro. You're not going to miss. Trust me. But um, we're gonna look at this build at a 99 perspective, y'all. This is when this build shines. Your driving layup, man, it's already an 80, so you will be getting all the little fancy layup packages like Steph Curry, long athlete, floater specialist, those type of things. Your dunk is a 66, but at 99, it will jump up to a 70, so that means you will get pro dunks. So you'll have front clutches, you'll have tomahawks, you know those type of builds. I mean, them, those type of dunks. For your mid-range shot, it will jump up to an 87. Your three-point shot is gonna jump up to an 87. Your ball control is gonna jump up to a 91. Your perimeter defense, like the defense on this is kind of crazy though, I ain't gonna lie. 
Your perimeter defense is going to jump up to an 80. Your lateral quickness is going to jump up to an 80. Your steals is jumping up to an 87. An 87, and you're not even a lockdown build, bro. That's ridiculous. Um, Your defense will rebound just because we upgraded it. I'm not really going to be going for boards with this build, but it will jump up to a 71. Now for the physicals on this build, man. Y'all know I love the physicals on every build, bro, because I love the speed, bro. The speed kills. Your speed is jumping up to a 99. Your acceleration is jumping up to a 98. Your strength, yeah, we're guard, but yeah, I guess I'll put it in there. Your strength is jumping up to a 46. And your vertical is jumping up to a 72. And like, this build goes crazy in 99, bro. This build, we get four takeover options, man. We get playmaking, we get chakra, and we get sharp, and we get slashing. Now, I'm gonna tell y'all the worst to the best. Slashing is the worst takeover for this build because we do not get contact guns with this build, bro. So, just go ahead and cross slash now. If you wanna pick slashing, man, feel free to, but I'm not picking slash. The next one I would definitely have to say is between shot creating and playmaking. Shot creating is a good badge if you want to fade, if that's your playstyle. That's not necessarily my playstyle, but look, if it's yours, man, feel free to. Playmaking, you can go for clips and break people now that ankle breakers are back in the game and dodge your teammates. But look, Sharp is the best takeover for this build, bro, because Sharp is just so deadly. You can shoot from anywhere with this uh, badge, and you can fade from anywhere with this badge, bro. So, hey, Sharp. Hey, when you got when you got the um, choice to pick sharp tape, bro, pick sharp tape. And there y'all have it, man. The offensive threat, man. The OG offensive threat. Let's go ahead and get the build up to 99. Put the badges on, man. Y'all know the vibes. This is not really your build at 99, man. I don't know why 2K does this. It's really your build at 95 overall. So if you want to know your stats at 99, man, just add plus 4 to all your attributes on the left. And then plus 8 to your physicals on the right. All right, now for finishing. We got 9 of them things. So we're going to ride with Contact Finisher, Relentless Finisher, and Slithery Finisher. Now, you can rock with it like this as well. I'd definitely probably rock with it like this, though, because Giant Slayer is going to help out a lot whenever you drive in the paint with, because you are 6'2". For shooting, we got 16 of them things, man. That's enough. Range Extender, High Zone Hunter, Green Machine, Difficult Shots. Difficult Shots is still broken, y'all. You just got to time it right. You got to time it perfect or you're going to miss. That's all that is, bro. You got you to gotta know your fade timing, bro. For Playmaking, man, we got 21 of them things, man. So we're going to rock with Unpluckable, Quick First Step, Handles for days, Dimer, Floor General, and Bellock. Now, depending on your teammate, depending on your teammate, if he doesn't like Dimer, you can put it on Ankle Breaker, bro. Ankle Breaker is overpowered this year, bro. It's too overpowered. Literally, man. Like, snatch bags, uh, hesitations, the behind the back, bro. You get so many Ankle Breakers this year off of it, bro. So, hey, y'all didn't know, man. Ankle Breaker is overpowered this year, bro. For defense, we got six of them things, man. So it really depends, man. If you're playing twos, man, definitely clamps and pick dodger. But if you're playing threes and you're not guarding the ball, bro, interceptor, um, rim protector, trapper, and you could put on chase down artists as well, bro. But look, if y'all enjoyed this video, man, let me know down in the comment section down below. Make sure y'all like the video up, man. Let's get, uh, what I say, 30 likes on this video. If you're new to the channel, man, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. But look, um, and yeah, make sure y'all follow my Twitch, man. The streams be lit over there. But look, if I don't see y'all boys until my next stream or my next video, I'm going to see y'all boys when I see y'all, man. I appreciate y'all. And I'm...